Today we welcome you inside of the New York Red Bulls training facility. I am Michelle Montaigne, joined by Ibrahim Sakaya, a name that is synonymous with the Red Bulls organization. Coach, you've been such a big part of this club for so long, and it's been such a big part of your life. In your current role as the head coach of Red Bulls too, what's the most important part to you about getting to really help shape this next generation of players in this club that means so much? No, I think the most important thing to see the young boys coming up. I think this is the, the role for us, like it, <clears throat> with my staff, being the head coach for the second team, and seeing the young players coming from our academy, going into the first team, some like traveling away from here to go to another clubs in Europe. Well, this is the most interesting when you see the young players growing up. Well, we had a bunch of players been here for long, seeing Adam, Tyler Adams, where he is, uh, Matt Miazika, a few and longer, you can see how they are, but seeing them when they are growing and where they are, this is the most important. The whole point of this league is to get guys to that point, right? It's to see them get to the next level. But there's obviously a lot of pressure that comes with that. How do you help the guys who have maybe get, gotten some of that exposure manage that pressure while playing at this level? No. For us here in the club, I think we, the, the most important we talk to the players is uh, about the growing, about to understanding the way how the club works, how they, we want the players to grow into our system. This is the most important. We don't put too much players uh, with the players. They have to enjoy also. We, but the most important to understand the next step where we want them to be so that everything, as long as they understand the way how we play, this is, is the most important couple guys who really understand how you play, Ibrahim Kasule, a couple other guys who are on this roster who are actually from your home country of Uganda. How would you describe the relationship you have with Ibrahim and Frank and Steven? No, it's, I, I can say I'm like a father to them. Mm -hmm. I've seen them growing up and getting the players like that to get a chance to be into this organization. Kasule has done a fantastic job with Steven and Frank. You can see where they are. Those are the players, we saw them at home, and I knew that they can be able to do what they are doing, and they are still growing up. I don't think they already seen what they have to do, but they are still growing up. It's exciting to see them, and this is gives another young players like the country where they are coming from, so that they can get a chance. How did you know? Yeah, I, I went back home, and then I, I saw them when they are playing, but the connection which I have from my country is, is big when I went them, when I see them and then talk about the club and I knew that they can go from here and the club, we saw what they have, they are fantastic players. Coming over mm -hmm. to the United States from a different country, I know there's got to be some time for that acclimation process to take place. How do you help them get used to like the burgers, the food, the new people, everything's new. How do you help them adjust? I think for them, for them, it's a different. I think the time they came here, I was here and I've been out for so long, I understand it. And I think the United States is a different country. They have all foods, they have, all, we can find what they want to eat, but the best way is, is me being here. I think I help them a little bit and I have family here. We try to cook our food home and then from there, but now they, they understand they eat the food which we need them to be eating. Are you telling me that you cook sometimes? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Okay, favorite thing to cook. <laughs> or best thing you can cook. It's gonna be difficult for you to understand it because it's a food from our country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they call it matoke. Okay, yeah. okay. Matoke. I have some research to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, coach, I know it's early in the second season for you guys, but how have you seen your club, the league, evolve in just the amount of time that Red Bulls Tool has been part of MLS Next Pro? No, it's growing. I think the first year when we came in, we are trying to understand the way the league, but I think every year, for me, the first year, we will try to understand the rules, the way how it's going, and then now we are in the second year where we feel like we understand well. And the teams, every team is growing up now. We see a lot of teams, they have good players, younger players are coming. I think this is the league which we see is going to be growing up in a couple of years coming. There are a lot of talent players in there, a lot of clubs. We're excited to see the league continue to grow and of course you guys continue to grow with it. Coach, thank you so much for the time. No problem, thank you guys.